Aluta believes that bringing the Grammys to Africa would diminish the value of the prestigious award scheme. And Paluta argues that African artists should continue to travel outside of their continent to receive the award so it adds to their prestige and allows them to catch the attention of major music labels. And in an interview, the Asida composer compressed, um, expressed concern that if the event were organized in Africa, influential music executive might not attend. This, in turn, would not bode well for artists who aspire to attract the interests of prominent record label. Let me start from Nanama. Mm -hmm. He says they should keep the award where they are because anything that the white man desires to bring to Africa loses its value. We want to travel abroad to receive the award. That is the symbol of prestige, and that is all we desire. <laughs> he says, It won't have any, you know, solid value. <laughs> Watch an hmm. And everybody's entitled to. But you do, you, do you think Grammys uh, <clears throat> should be brought down to Ghana? This is African version. Doesn't mean that yeah. they are actually going to, you know, end the whole Grammys. You understand? It is African version. The other time we were actually talking about this whole thing, and I was saying that um, there are good musicians somewhere here in Africa that we don't even hear of. There are better musicians. Mm. People that we hear of all the time are people that are trying, pushing, striving to get there. Someone might be somewhere doing a whole lot of things, putting in the works, but still he's not heard. He's not that global, you understand? Yeah. So with this kind of thing, it's going to help people. It's going to help on earth people that are, you know, at some places where we, we have know. no idea of. So something like this is something that's going to help. No, I mean, Ghana, we a free home fuse. I don't know, 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 I don't uh, my person make I. Oh, I know my DJ sa Grammy seno. I na nyami adum. Rocky Dawunia aya onya nomination. Ghana wa na aji Grammy. What you say? Oh, Kim Paluta. I ya wa dekra po se. Wa 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 wa. Time a ube muno. I na dey we cry ba. Na nyami adum wo di asi dey be cry we dey. Aku aku fa waje. Oh, tina wa se yen yen wa broche. Yen wa broche. Wa na se wo no wo ni ne bedu hano. You understand? Because you didn't have a answer, though you didn't have a answer. Ghana from Ghana, you see. But since this one, it's African, so I think if you do anything that is indigenous, I mean, it could be heard, it could be you know considered. Into what now? I can say na ebe losing the ebe losing the value in what way? This is the African version, and to me, I feel like it is a good um, step that they are taking. The Grammys, they've actually surveyed, they've done their. Um, researches, investigations, and everything. And they know how uh, the Africans are actually, you trying. know, trying. Sometimes we are not heard there because what they are doing is their awards for mm. them, not for us. And since you say, TGM, your category B, ah, I know, no, Yedema, Obi, or what outside. How many categories we have in there that is given to people that are not here in Ghana? You understand? So, I want to mean yam farm ma obi o deserve it all the time. Into with we no kwa nebe who say okay competition no kwa be tight because you see I need na kwa kujina Nigeria for no kwa so all the time they are the ones getting them. Last year na I think Tyler and na Libyanka so so edgy before nenyom you know you understand. Into a kwa kwa yes edgy na nimpa fa kwa so Ghana for so try ya se and yes a Ghana any good music. But do you think over here in Ghana we are ready to host the Grammys? We are not even are part we, of the, the countries that... Yeah, I'm trying to say, if, if it should come down, mm. are we ready to host it? Are we equipped enough? Do we have the structures, everything in place to host the Grammys? Well, Hetty, uh, I think we do. Mm. Because uh, if they're going to do something like that here, uh, they have their own, you know, um, um, what can they... Uh, Equipment? Uh, yes, and then... People their own that logistics, logistics and the academy. And you understand. So we, we are going to have people like that there. 
and they're going to decide on what they want, what they want to, how they want the whole thing to be like. And we're definitely going to have Ghanaians, uh, some Ghanaians supporting. You understand? And so I don't know what they are going to need that we can't. I was asking this uh, just because of the just ended. Is it the all African uh, games? Games, yeah. That happened. We saw, we saw some of the, the technical issues, you know, lighting system, um, logistics, some things. But we, we also hosted a Global Citizen Award, uh, mm. Awards Festival, mm. and it went perfectly well. Yeah, it was okay. beautiful. You understand? In Tinebiana, oh, 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 the reason, reason I'm yeah. asking this, you know, Global Citizen is not an indoor event. It's an outdoor event. Sure. And Grammys so, is an indoor event. Exactly. So, so uh, if do we have the auditorium? Do we have the place ready? Do we have a place that can cut to the standard of Grammy? Looking at their stage set up, lighting and all these things. Well, should the opportunity be given to us, will we meet it? Huh, I want to be asked them because I quite grammy say we are not a normal because you're not going to host only Ghanaians, yeah, we are going to host other people from other countries. A bit me, quite a bit me if you have a but that's for an idea. And Tina said, if auditorium is so enough to contain all these people, like, I think that one is going to be a minus for us because what's your yeah, even census near the world, Ghana, and contain me, sir, you know. So I think we, we need more of that. But since I ain't do way, I ain't come cry, but I'm sure she'll be hosting to me. I'm sure they'll be quite with you. Nice one, Christero. Paluta. Um, I, I understand where he's coming from. Okay. Yes. You see, we as Ghanaians and Africa, Africans, if you travel to get anything outside, Charlie, the prestige that we attach to some of these things. I had a huge, eh? Chrome Hamboe, Obi, two coin coverage, you school, Fitri Fitri B. That's a certificate to the soul. Or indicate it's a cool school, Abruci, that's Abruci, if it's not even one of the best schools, if it's Fitri school, Crampo now. When he brings the certificate, yeah, when the person brings the certificate down here, it's, it's valued more than, you know, what we have here. I mean, that is what is happening. So I understand where he is coming from. And, and, He's not far from right. Mm. You know, just traveling to America, your name is mentioned on the stage. You have all these great guys, these American, you know, musicians all around. You know, your name is mentioned, Kim Paluta, go for a Grammy Award. I mean, uh, I, I'm just imagining how it's going to feel like. I mean, the feeling and you know, everything. I mean, it will be great. I understand. Uh, you see, we should also understand that African music is gaining ground. Mm. Yes, African music is gaining ground. I have, I have heard people made, you know, in fact, people make arguments of the fact that, yes, they want to, yes, of course, they want to tap into our market. And before someone decides to tap into your market, it is because the person has seen something good in your market. That is why they want to tap into your market. Mm. So I, I can see that, yes, Afri that, uh, African music has come of age you know even here in ghana tgma initially they were not uh, uh awarding afro beats yeah. now we have afro beat song afro beat artists yeah so it means that gradually things are changing and so when things change you know situations also change so for me um since they have already created latin grammys there's the latin grammys mm -hmm. where a Grammy is awarded uh, to uh, uh, or, or musicians that do songs in, in, in Portuguese and Spanish are awarded. So that has already been created somewhere in 1997. People have not had issues with it. Why do we want to have issues with our own? Yes, I mean, these people, they can do anything. But you can choose to be a part of it or not. And I, am, I, I, I also believe that, yeah, they want to tap into our market. But tapping into our market means also that our market, there's something good in our market. So let's see. I, I am for it. I am for it. African music has come of age. And if they feel that, yeah, they want to organize uh, the, the African version of Grammy or Grammy Africa, just like we have Latin Grammys, I mean, it, it is good. Let's embrace it. It is not going to be your normal or your usual, uh, uh, you know, that award scheme where you would have to go and uh, 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 buy, what, what do you call it, uh, use your money to vote for the award and all of that. No. This one, a proper uh, 
academy will be established where artists you know will be awarded who, when they as deserve. Where they deserve so that is that is how i am looking at it mm. yeah.